Hello and welcome back. Uh, in this tutorial, we are going to learn that how to read the content of one file and uh, write the write that read content to the another file in a C++. So uh, I'm assuming that I'm already having a file uh, with the name, uh, let's suppose data.txt. So this is my file and I ha I'm having a, some content and I'm going to copy that content into some other file. So uh, here I'm going to uh, just uh, declare a stream uh, just for the input file, input file stream, i file. And here I'm going to pass the reference of data.txt text. So this is the file I want to uh, read, fine. So now uh, parallelly I'm going to declare output file stream o underscore file so uh, i have to give a name uh, of a new file fine let's take a new dot text so now this file i have opened in input mode and this file i'm going to uh, i had declared for the output mode so now uh, let's read uh, the data uh, or a content from a data dot text so we already learned how to read the data. So here I'm going to use i underscore file dot cat. And uh, I'm going to declare a character variable c. I'm going to use c as an intermediate. Uh, it will acting as a buffer, you can say. So now I read the one character from this data text a data dot text file. So I'm going to write it uh, to the new text file. So here I'm going to write o underscore file um, dot I'm going to use a put method put c. What I have read in the c I'm going to put it into the another file. So this is just the logic. So now I'm done with the logic i file dot close now again o file dot close so i close both of the streams so let's see what this program is going to output okay so let's give a copy file okay so now, uh, okay, I hadn't displayed any message. So let's see that new text file has created. So you can see I have, uh, you know, read the data from this file and I copied into the another file. So you can display some message over here. See out um, data return successful. Uh, let's make space. So now, again, I can run. So data returns successfully, and uh, you can see the same data is there. So that was the program of about your reading the content of one file uh, and putting the content into the another file. So in the next video lecture, we are going to learn that how to read and write the objects uh, to the file. Okay, keep subscribe uh, to my YouTube channel. And if you hadn't subscribed yet, please subscribe it uh, so that you will have uh, updated uh, video information. Right? Okay, thanks for watching.